Happy Easter everyone! Hello my lovely babies! Welcome back! Today's video is a very short vape vlog. Alright guys, so today me and Hello Kitty are matching and we are doing a very short vape vlog because one, it is Easter and two, The Walking Dead is on tonight and I am so freaking stoked. So really quickly, I'll just run down what we're going to do. We're going to do giveaway winners. I don't actually have any vlog footage that I'm ready to put up yet. I was going to do a Saturday video yesterday and put up the video of me doing the local vape shop giveaway that I did, but I'm just going to put that in probably sometime this next Next week coming because it was Saturday and that's like usually my only day off that I take from actually doing a video so we're gonna do winners I'm gonna do e-liquid of the week and then test out a flavor like a one single spotlight flavor and announce another giveaway as you can probably tell by the title so my e-liquid of the week was really actually easy to pick I would definitely have to pick and this is not just because I love the walking dead but the walking vaped e-liquid this is the strawberry labo tomate which is like a mixture of strawberry lemonade and lobotomy that word mixed together this is really freaking good I love strawberry lemonade vapes for the summertime but I also felt like naked fish's wahoo deserved a little mention because I'm really particular when it comes to cereal vapes and this one was freaking good. It was super good. It might be up in my top. I can't say it's my top yet because I don't have like th my favorite cereal vape of all time is the Kilo cereal milk but I don't have any right now to kind of compare the two together right now but I definitely say that this would probably be squeaking into my top cereal vapes. So in last week's vape vlog I was giving away three Raphael tanks with three packs of coils and the VRBA base. So there's going to be three lucky winners who win the tank itself, the Raphael tank, three packs of coils. These are all different resistances. We got a 0.1 pack, a 0.2 pack, and a 0.5 pack, and the VRBA base kit. So I recorded picking the three winners on the random YouTube comment picking website that I usually use for these giveaways so you'll be able to see the winners being picked in real time. But I'm going to go ahead and read off their comments from my iPad. And look, I got a new iPad case because my other one was totally breaking and it was an expensive one and it kept, it was chipping off so I was pretty mad about that. I asked you guys to tell me what your favorite place to shop was online for vape stuff and I was really surprised at how many people said Amazon and eBay because I would never personally shop there for vape stuff only because I just don't know how trusted that can be and I've heard like horror stories and then I was surprised about how many people shop at like ePuff stores directvapor.com, uh, vaporDNA.com, there was also what, uh, My Freedom Smokes, so many people were saying those four websites, those are the ones that sticked out in my mind besides actually eBay and Amazon. And then I was really surprised at how many people say they do not shop online, they go to their local brick and mortar, which is just fine. I was just, I thought everybody shopped online because that's where I get like 99.9% .9 of my vape stuff is online shopping. Anyways, so the first winner is Patricia Rodriguez. She says, I, hi, I like to shop online at Craft Vapery, but in person I go to ePuff. So you must live where they have a ePuff brick and mortar. That's crazy because I shop online at ePuffStore.com. And she shared to Facebook. So congratulations, Patricia. You have won the Raphael tank. The second winner is Elizabeth Smith. She says, hello, I am new to online shopping for my vape, but I have bought e-juice directly from Bonsai Vapors. Woo! And it was super easy. Speaking of Bonsai, Pound It is amazing. Yes, it is. And she shared this on Twitter, this that video. So congratulations, Elizabeth. E Elizabeth Smith, you are the second winner. And the third winner for the Raphael tank is Carly Jo. She says, hey, Tia, I shared on Twitter, and my favorite online vape store is my vapors." store.com love your vids thank you congratulations and that was another one myvaporstore.com that a lot of people were putting down in the comments so congratulations to you three you are the winner of the Raphael tank little kit bundle so just make sure to reply to my comment I'll be commenting to these I'll be replying to these comments on the original video last week and we can discuss how you're going to claim your prize most people just send me a picture of their face holding their ID to my Tia Vapes Facebook page that works just fine but you have to be able to prove that you're 18 or older in all of my giveaways it is 18 plus and you have to be able to provide proof no ifs ands or buts these are my giveaways we play by my rules here so as long as you guys can prove that you're 
18, I can have your prizes mailed out very soon. I usually tend to get the prizes sent out by Monday or Tuesday of the following week, which I really like to do because I kind of dedicated Monday and Tuesday as errand days, and that's part of my, my daily errands for those days. Alright, also... On Monday's video, last Monday, I did a video for Kendo Vape Cotton, which I am using in my RDA now. It's really good cotton. They have Gold Edition, the Original Vape Cotton, and they have the Eco Pack. And I'm doing a giveaway of all three of those, plus some little vape bands for Kendo Vape Cotton. And I said there will be two winners this time, so I went ahead and picked those winners right after I picked these winners. So you'll see that whole footage of me picking all the winners all in one and the first winner of the vape cotton is Roseanne Rosanna Roseanne Decker she says all hail the vape queen hi Tia I am from an itty bitty town called Bellwood I love all your videos and I am such a new went to when it comes to RDAs I have been very pleased though thank you for the opportunity to win some vape bands and cotton it is very much appreciated keep up the good work doll well thank you so much Roseanne Hope it's Roseanne. I'm pretty sure it's Roseanne and not like Rosanna because there's no A at the end. But you are the winner. Thank you so much for watching my videos. Just like I said before, I will be commenting. I'll be replying to this comment and we can figure out how you're going to prove you are 18 or older. I mean, I guess you can, you can buy cotton if you're not 18 or older. But this is specifically vape cotton. So I still want the same rules to apply. And the last winner of the vape cotton is Alice Tucker. I'm from the UK. I haven't got a clue how to make a coil for my RDA or anything, but I'm really lucky my best friend comes to my house and does it all for me. Would be nice to be able to have my own cotton to use rather than stealing his though. Oh, I know all about having friends make your own coils because I don't make my own coils, but oh my god, I installed my very first pre-made coil on my RDA because up until now I've just been wicking it, like re-wicking it all by myself and having my friends build the coils and install it and do everything for me, but I got some pre-made coils sent to me by the vape guys a long time ago and I still had some of those so I pre-installed my own coil at first and we gotta talk about this when we get to that segment all right so we're going to pick some winners for the Raphael tank from this last week's vape vlog and we're gonna go over here to the random comment picker and load all the comments no Alex can you guys hear my cat? He is literally so annoying. Alright, randomly pick the winner. From Minnesota, and they like to shop at Craft Vapor. Okay, winner number one. And the next winner. Winner number two. And winner number three. There we go. Now we are going to go pick the Kendo Vape Cotton winners. So here is the Kendo Vape Cotton video. I'm gonna copy and paste that URL. And go over here and oh go back to home I guess. No, that's not YouTube random. Okay, here we go. Paste load comments. And there's gonna be two winners from this one. Random. There we go. Let's see. That is a winner. And next. Um, that is not a winning comment, but thank you for the information. We'll pick again. There we go. So, I'm going to try an e-liquid, but I just wanted to say this. Okay, so I told you guys I installed this pre-made coil all by myself. It's supposed to be a 0.4, but it's reading anywhere from 0.7 to 0.9 every time I like mess with it a little and then put it and then turn it on and see what it's reading and I'm like nervous because it's supposed to be a 0.4 but it's reading it at a higher ohm so I'm feeling like is the something wrong with the coil like what is going on because I don't know I'm such a noob and I thought pre-made coils were going to be the way to go the easiest way for me and how hard is it to install a coil I made sure all the little screws are really tight I made sure it's not touching anything and the coil's fine and I got some advice like to squeeze the coil to stroke the coil so I did all that stuff and it's still it's still reading right now it's reading a 0 0.9 almost a point almost a one ohm and so I'm just like what how did I mess this up so if you have any super awesome tips for me about what could be going on with this 0.4 coil it's supposed to be 0.4 
but it's not reading it and I'm just like at a loss because I don't have anyone that can come up here to help me right now so I'm just going to have to do make do with this and try out this flavor. So I was getting those tips from people on Twitter and I thought what this came at a perfect time because everyone's like oh squeeze the coils, stroke the coils, so like this would be the perfect little tool right? This got sent to me by Coil Master and they're just some vape tweezers but check them out like these are probably perfect for that and I think this might be like a bottle opener or like if you get something stuck you know like if the coil's stuck or the cap is stuck on anything it has that grip there so I thought these were pretty cool and they sent me more than one pair so I threw the extra into my giveaway box for my next big giveaway but anyways moving on today I am trying out dough nuts like dough like Homer Simpson says dough check this out you guys have to see this focus camera look at this looks just like the donuts from the Simpsons so this is the donut e-juice. This is Max VG, 30 milliliters and 3 milligrams. This is my personal va vaping preference. I got this sent to me by, I think, electroniccigarette.com. I don't know. I'll link below. Mm, it smells good, though. Mostly smells like frosting and like a, there's like a little hint of lemon, which I'm sure that's not what it's supposed to be. So I'm going to go ahead and taste it on this coil that's not reading what it's supposed to be. And like, I mean, if I'm doing something that you probably shouldn't be doing you should probably only vape on a coil when it's reading what it's supposed to but I don't have time to, to figure it out I don't know what I could be doing wrong because see it fires I mean it works so I don't know we'll give it a shot I guess Ooh, baby hmm I wonder if it's supposed to be a strawberry donut. Because I'm getting strawberry. Like a strawberries and cream donut. Well, obviously, it's pink frosting, so it has to be strawberry frosting, right? Ooh. Yeah. I like this flavor. It kind of reminds me of, like, a strudel. Like a strawberry strudel, maybe. Like... But I am getting that doughy, thick, because like a donut like has like a thick bread. Strudel's kind of flaky. You're getting definitely a thicker, fuller bite. Mmm. Yeah. Mmm. Usually I'd be all over a flavor like this, but because it's Easter and I've had a lot of Easter food and a lot of Easter sweets, I'm just like, oh, <laughs> it's too sweet. But I'm definitely going to be keeping this flavor and vaping it at a later date. So really quickly, before I announce this next giveaway that I'm really excited to do, um, one of the Crixus tank winners did not get a hold of me. They didn't get back to me. I replied to their comment and waited. So it's been, it's been two weeks now. Has it? Yeah, it's been two weeks. So... I guess they are not going to come forward for their Crixis. What do you guys think I should do? Should I redraw for a Crixis right now? Or should I throw it into my giveaway box and be it'll be part of a big giveaway bundle like I kind of did with my 75,000 subscriber giveaway? So what should I do? I will, I'll let you guys decide. I will either redraw like next week or something or just do throw it into the big pile. Alright guys, so since it is the holiday and I am just so always in the giving mood because I just get so much vape stuff that I just feel like continuing my giveaways. I started a giveaway every single week when I, I hit 75,000 subscribers and then I did a giveaway every single week for six weeks and then now I've been continuing that and each vape vlog I've been doing a giveaway because it's just, it's so much fun and I just have all this extra stuff that I've been wanting to give away for you guys and so I have another giveaway because one, it's Easter and two, I just I don't think I want to stop. I think one giveaway a week is pretty fun for everybody. I mean, as long as the supplies last, why not do a giveaway? So this week, I'm going to be giving away a sample box. This is a platinum box, and yes, they are catered to my vaping preference. So hopefully we have the same vaping preference. There is 11 bottles in this box, and I'm not just giving away one, but one lucky person is going to win three months of platinum sample boxes from yours truly. So we can see here, oh, open this one up. We have a full, oh, got that stuff too. 
We have a full example box. That's just the first layer. So there will be one winner, and the winner will contact me, and I will be mailing out a sample box each month to them for three months. So you can get, like, the real... I'm not going to... Because I have all three boxes now, but I'm not going to mail out all three boxes at once. I want you to get the full, like, sample box experience. So I'll be mailing out one sample box for three months, and that's not all. The winner will also get their own Raphael tank, which I just did a giveaway for on this video. And they will get this and then, of course, the three packs of coils and, of course, the RBA base. This will go out, like, this will be the first thing that I mail out is this box and this tank. Because, I mean, you're going to get all these e-liquids. Might as well get a new tank to try them all out in. Ooh. Mm, so good. Still vaping on my green knee box. Thanks, Chris. So all you have to do to win three months of platinum sample boxes is share this video anywhere on social media, give it a like, and comment down below where you're from and what is your favorite flavor category. Because I am like a fruity dessert vapor. Those are my favorite. Are you a fruity dessert vapor? Do you like savory flavors? Do you like tobacco flavors? What is your vape? What is like... Let's see, let's see, there's like tobacco, menthol, savory, sweet, fruity. Like, which one of those is your favorite e-liquid flavor category? I'd love to know down below, and hopefully it's the same as mine, which is fruity and dessert, because that's what those boxes are filled with, different fruity and different desserty flavors. And I'll be picking one winner to receive three months' worth of sample box in next week's vape vlog. So good luck to everybody. You have to be 18 years or older. This is e-liquid with nicotine in it. So you have to be able to prove that you're 18 or older if you are the winner, if you become the winner, if your name is drawn. You have to be able to prove it and most people just send me a picture of their face and their ID to my Facebook. That's the best way that it's worked so far. So good luck to everyone. And that about wraps it up for this quick little vape vlog. I'm going to go get ready for the Walking Dead episode on tonight and then the season finale oh my god no spoilers so i hope everyone had a fun and happy easter if you celebrate it and that's it for today's video if you enjoyed give it a thumbs up and feel free to subscribe to this channel for more reviews a whole new week of new vape videos coming at you you can check the description box below for important links like where to get the e-liquid of the week or to get the e-liquid that i tried that donut e-liquid i'll also link below to example box if anybody is interested in checking it out you can follow me on almost any social media site like instagram twitter or facebook I am always on Twitter talking to you guys. I love Twitter. That's like where I go to chat. I do have a second YouTube channel where I upload random videos of whatever I feel like. So if you want to see more of me that's not vaping related, you can check out that channel. All those links will be below. And one more thing before you go, if vaping is something you're passionate about, please consider joining Casa.org and fight for your right to vape. So as always, I'm Tia Vapes and thank you so much for watching.